Well, James, uh, another Champions League defeat. How tough was that one to take? Yeah, it's obviously tough. Um, you obviously you wanted to finish the final game, especially at home. Um, you know, with a positive result, uh, we couldn't do that. But you know, it's a it's a learning curve that we'll have to take in our stride and. You know, going forward, we'll learn from this and, you know, we'll only come back stronger. What will you take from this campaign as a whole? A lot of tough ones to take, I'm sure, but some very important lessons to learn as you look to get back here next year. Uh, yeah, yeah. You know, it's the finer details in these games and uh, that when you're playing against this quality um, opposition, you know, if it's a loose pass or, you know, if you switch off for two seconds, you know, they can punish you. So they're the finer details that you have to, you know, work on going forward. And I'm sure we will do that. Um, you know, we've, you know, the squad's going to come back stronger, and we'll move forward. You spoke about switching off. Is that something that happened tonight a couple of times defensively? Um, yeah, and obviously you get punished for it. Um, but like I said, you know, we'll learn from this. Um, you know, it was a proud moment for all of us uh, to come into this competition. But we're not obviously done ourselves justice. Uh, we're not giving, you know, the fans, you know, the minimum that they wanted. And you know we'll own up to that, and you know only apologise. But you know it's a, it's a learning curve where we have to you know be better at this, especially in this competition. Yeah, I'm, I'm impressed by your frankness. Do you feel that the fans deserve an apology for the, the campaign? We obviously want to do better, and you know the first half, I believe we could have fought a bit more. Um, you know more hunger in the first half. We just lacked a little bit better second half, but we can't. In these games you can't wait for 45 minutes and. You know, because you'll just get punished. Yeah. So, you know, we never want to get beat. You know, we're a club known for trophies and known for winning games. And we did that. We did ourselves really well last season, getting to the Europa final, uh, playing against big teams. And sure. We wanted to do that this season. And, you know, we've obviously not met, met the mark, but we'll learn from it. I'm not trying to trip you up, James, but you said you maybe lacked a little bit of fight, a little bit of hunger in this game. That'll be concerning to Rangers fans that, that their captain is saying they weren't hungry enough, maybe they didn't want it enough in this match. Can you understand no, that? Well, it's, not, it's, it's, it's one of those where I believe that Alex, Alex had, obviously, uh, a lot more days off before this game. Uh, you know, we've, we've missed a lot of players and played a lot of games. Um, but, you know, with their fresh legs, you can see the combinations that were moving freely. And it was something that we couldn't really get close to. So I probably won't say the, the hunger and the fight, just they're a quality side who have a lot of rotations, quality players. Um, but just moments, you know, when we could have got close to him, you know, we didn't. But we did that second half, and you know, you see now Fredo get a chance towards the end, and uh, that's what we need to do going forward. James, appreciate your time and your honesty. Cheers, thank thank you. you.